Okay, so uh, you were at the bus rally or something? The, yes, um, I was at the bus rally. I'm Martha Perez, general political activist, and um, it was a wonderful turnout. It, the, the event was cross-posted by over over a dozen different major organizations working in collabor collaboration and coalition. A number of um, organizers and a few elected officials turned out um, with a, speak, a sp speech by uh, Amanda Fritz, a uh, city councilwoman. So we are targeting the climate um, and protesting the budget cuts. Um, well, turned, well turned out, um, just a number of chants were sung. Uh, a lot of, a lot what of was it about again, just to refresh people? To protest the, the uh, price, the expenses, um, the increase in um, bus fares that TriMet is enacting um, as of yesterday, as a matter of fact. A five cent increase? Correct. And they also cut some bus lines back in Correct, time schedules. Correct, severely cut, yeah. And How many people were out here? A party? How many people were protesting, there would were, you say? There were dozens, there were dozens, over a hundred at, at least. Um, and then we also had we also had public stories uh, by a variety of speakers talking to us about what the impact is going to be on, on their work and school and, and employment and health care. Um, we even noted a speaker that mentioned the impact having to wait longer in, for a bus impacts her health because she has diabetes and it's, it's a hardship to have to wait, you have to, when you're diabetic it's hard to maneuver in the bus system. You could, you could sit there and liter literally pass out from um, like high blood sugar or low blood sugar waiting and not being able to get to meal sites and young people were concerned about um, the bus cuts affecting their ability to be mobile and independent from, from their parents and being able to be self-sufficient. So a number of issues, important issues were brought up at the bus rally yesterday. And you guys walked up to City Hall? Correct. We, we, we staged the protest and event in front of City Hall on the 4th Avenue side and, um, and just let our message be heard loud and clear. And this event was sponsored by Opal, but in, was supported by at least a dozen different major organizations working together on transportation issues and um, economic justice issues. Did anybody from City Hall come out and acknowledge you guys? Or? Um, Amanda Fritz, the commissioner, did acknowledge us. I did not see, I stayed for the entire event and did not see any other commissioners or the mayor come out and, and endorse or um, speak at our event, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. And that was disappointing. <laughs> the whole uh, protest lasted about a little over an hour or so? Over an hour uh -huh. or so, yeah. And okay. there was people giving speeches. Uh, there was a table of information. People were encouraged, people were being encouraged to sign up. Um, get more information and get involved. All right. Thanks for telling me about You're it. You're welcome. Thanks for ahead. being there, too. Please.